captured the intense flames from a pre-dawn fire that broke out in Bay Point today. It destroyed two homes and damaged two others. Seven people hospitalized, one with burns and six with smoke inhalation. KPX 5 reporter Kit Doe reports from the scene where investigators believe they know what triggered that fire. It, it must make you shake your head. You know, when you do this long enough, you don't, uh, things don't surprise you after a while. Investigators say somebody likely got high with the drug pipes and lighters they found inside this minivan and started a fire that nearly burned down the whole neighborhood. You know, sometimes people who are high will do stupid stuff. The fire in the minivan spread quickly and jumped to the house, but raged on for some time before anybody called 911. The flames jumped to three more houses. It was a frantic evacuation as people ran through the heat and smoke and tried to fight the flames with garden hoses. Oh. Araceli Hurtado watched in horror as her own house burned. She and her three kids escaped okay, but says her life and dreams are gone. All my pictures, all my memories are gone. Her sister, Nuvia, says she saw people doing drugs in the van at all hours of the day and called police multiple times. She says all this pain and suffering could have been prevented. Everybody was, saw it coming, you know, something's going to happen. It was just a bomb waiting to explode. A total of seven people were injured, mostly with smoke inhalation, and one man suffered burns to his back. All injuries described as minor. Total cost of the damage, $850,000. In Bay Point, Kitto, KPIX5.